For joining us here today, my name is Tristan Randall. I'm the Strategic Projects Executive for Autodesk's uh, infrastructure business. Uh, we're lucky to be joined today by a number of different Autodesk people involved, both on the product side as well as uh, in the infrastructure business specifically. We're also joined today by uh, a number of people from 3D Robotics. And we're excited today to talk about our partnership with 3D Robotics that we are uh, starting up and uh, as, as part of our uh, launching of the RECAP Web API program. Now, this is an exciting program that gives partners uh, access to this uh, platform in which they can build additional capability on top of the already very robust uh, RECAP tools available both for laser and photo processing. Uh, today, we're going to conduct a research and development project using their UAV platform. We're going to be flying two different UAVs today, and then ultimately this data will be processed using uh, our RECAP platform. Uh, so really excited to have you all here today. Um, we're going to get started here in a few minutes by capturing some of the beautiful features here at Garden of the Gods Park. It's basically, the, pl the plan is going to be that we're going to fly uh, two separate missions today. Uh, we're going to fly over an individual feature and we're going to use uh, uh, information from the camera to autonomously uh, fly around the feature and capture, uh, capture several different angles of uh, some of these features and then reconstruct that in 3D. Uh, the second project we're going to, uh, or second mission we're going to run, is going to be flying traditional flight lines to capture a somewhat larger area, which then we'll be uh, using in our engine. We're going to be monitoring the, the flight throughout, but we're going to use some of the uh, some of the control that we have over the uh, over the UAV and over the camera to perform some autonomous functions. So the entire time we're going to have we're going to be monitoring where the where the UAV is. Um, in case in case we need to take manual control, uh, but because of the fact that we can uh, auto stabilize the aircraft as well as uh, use GPS waypoints to dictate its navigation, we can get a lot of advantages out of uh, using those autonomous features. But these uh, both aircraft that you see here are do have fully autonomous capabilities. Thank you. 